Recording. Well, good morning, everyone, and welcome to our Monday morning chat. Um, my name is Robin Blank Muscari, and our host this morning is Karen O'Neill. She's been away for a little while, and we are so happy to have her back. She's one of our directors. Uh, Karen came in early on, and uh, she's she's been through a lot in the last several months through her own um, accident, surgery, and then her husband passing. And um, I'm so, so, so happy that she's back with us today. And she is, uh, she and Michelle will be alternating as our uh, Monday morning chat host. So I'm going to turn it over to you, Karen. Well, thank you, Robin. Hi, everybody. Um, for those of you who know me, you know, I've been through a lot. And I want to first thank you for all the wonderful messages I've gotten from our community. It has really helped me. Um, I couldn't host for a while. I couldn't even do my hair after I broke my arm and shoulder and, and, um, and I'm just sort of getting back on my feet. So who knows how it's going to go. I think I'm going to be okay and dry eyed through the whole way. My husband did pass about um, two and a half months ago and it's pretty fresh and new. So um, thank you for hanging in there. Those of you that, that know me and, and have messaged me and I will be getting back to everybody eventually. I don't know how soon. So that's enough about me because this is not about me. This is about X39, LifeWave, our company, our patches, the wonderful things that we do. And this is this is one of my favorite calls of the week, although they're all kind of my favorite calls of the week. They're all amazing. Um, but I love it when we share our stories and how this has helped us. And I'm just gonna put in there, I can't prove it. There's no way to prove it, but I almost lost my husband um, two and a half some somewhere in there years ago and I really feel like the patches made a huge difference and brought him back I had an extra couple of years with him and I'm very grateful for that um, and the patches got me through a lot of stuff I tell you as my arm was um, after surgery and stuff I used patches I did not have the kind of pain that the doctors and nurses went say I'm starting with my story that's what I'm doing that they warned me about and um, I never lost a night after my surgery I never lost one night of sleep because of pain that's pretty huge when you've had a, a shoulder surgery so, and broken arm, it like broke off right underneath the, the shoulder. So that was my story. It's just a little tiny bitty glimpse of my story. And I'm going to ask you guys to come in and share your stories and remember that we don't make any medical claims. That is, we are not allowed to do that. We don't say that we treat, prevent or cure any disease. So please, you can talk about symptoms, all day long, but do not name that disease because um, that that is not okay. And we as you come not. on, I want to hear your wonderful stories. All right, so who'd like to go first? See if I know all the technology here. It's great if you raise your hand. Stacy, Stacy, you go. I'm in gallery view, so I can't see yeah. your own hand raised. Hey, good morning, everybody. It's good to see you, Karen. Thank you. Welcome, Welcome. back. Yay. <laughs> um, I have a very good uh, testimony with uh, actually a new distributor of mine. She um, has a lot of issues going on and specifically uh, here of late, the lower back has been giving her extreme pain. And I take notes. So I was like, okay, I've got something, possibly have something for her. So back on May 24th, I don't remember who said it, but I wrote it down. Um, if you put ice wave on the bladder 63, which is on the outside of both feet, it's, it's on both feet. Um, you can use one foot, I guess, but, um, this person used ice wave for someone and the low back pain went away. So I pulled up a picture of the acupuncture point for bladder 63, and it had some, some words on it, like for, you know, low back pain and walking and such and such and such. So I sent it to her because she had just texted me about um, her pain that wasn't going away with the X39. So she goes, well, I don't have any ice waves. So let me try the X39. Well, I saw her at church yesterday and she was walking in front of me and she had sandals on. So I saw, you know, something was taped on this side and something was taped on this side. So I kind of like walked really quick and I said, what you got on? And so she told me that that day she put on the X39 on both bladder 63 and the pain immediately went away. So I was like, oh my goodness, this is just awesome. And I started crying, you know, because she's such a sweet woman. But um, another lady uh, in our church, she's going through, you know, a lot of back pain too. So she actually went to her 
uh, I was telling her um, about the results that she has. And the, the one that she was talking to, she has the X39 and a couple of eons uh, as the free patches, but she's just like, I give up. I'm just in too much pain. And I've talked to her and everything. I'm like, okay, well, let's go both go to her, not bombard her and just share this testimony. So she's going to try them today. Um, she's got the X39. She's going to try the X39. But um, we just, this community is awesome because we talk to each other. We, we give testimonies and we write them down if, if we do. And then we can go back. We're like, wait a minute, let's just try this. And then we share it, the good news with everybody else. So I just wanted to let y'all know that the bladder 63 um, seems to work for lower back pain. Stacy, thank you. And that's one, you just added so much value to the call by, first of all, encouraging people, if one thing doesn't work, try it another way. That is huge because it's, it's amazing. I, it's almost jaw dropping what this product can do and in a very short amount of time. So thank you, Stacy. And welcome. I would like to remind everyone, please um, put yourself on mute until you talk, okay? Because the noises are really distracting and we'd appreciate it, especially dogs barking, which I love dogs. My dog hasn't barked yet, <laughs> but she might. Anyway, so who would like to go next? Thank you so much, Stacy. Uh, I might chime in because I'm the one that originally brought up the bladder 36 because it helped me so much with my back pain. And I just wanted to say, it, to clarify that I used Ice Wave white on the right and tan on the left on bladder 36. And it was the first time I was able to get rid of back pain that I've had for 20 to 25 years. So I'm thrilled to hear that X39 works too. And just wanted to point out that I've had that result with the ice wave. Awesome. Thank you. That was K, right? Yes. And that's bladder 36, right? Yes. You guys, and you can you can easily search and get these um, points, these accurate. Online, yes. And it's on the feet, which is very hard to understand how it works on your feet or your back, but it really does work well. Yeah, I'm hearing a lot. Okay, Karen, I did a global mute. So when anyone wants to speak, please mute your line. I mean, unmute your line. So Karen, unmute. Okay, I did. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, so yeah, thank you. So when you're ready, please unmute. Who'd like to go next? Let's have another Karen. great story. Hi, yes. Karen. Tim. Hi, Tim. I, I, I want to jump in on that. Just keep trying things. Dr. Nicholas always said, if you, you know, you don't get relief from whatever the symptom is, just keep trying other patches. And I have this business going on with my toes. Let's see, what's the new extreme discomfort where my toes meet my foot, like they won't bend. It feels like they're breaking it with every step and it swells and all of that good stuff. And so I tried the usual suspects um, without much success, X39 and Ice Wave and all, all of those. And um, finally it occurred to me to put glutathione right on the spot and in about 10 minutes, it's, it stopped kind of so suddenly that I thought, nah, that can't be. And I went all day and I never said anything. And then the next day I replaced the patch and finally said to Helen, you know, I think this is working. <laughs> and it, that's been three days and I haven't had it come back yet. So, and I'd had it for a long time. So just keep patching. Well, thank you, Tim. And that is so beautiful and so important. Awesome. So keep on trying. Try a different thing if one thing doesn't work. Hey, Karen, I just want to share with everyone, David Schmidt did a webinar on pain relief, and there's four patches that help with pain relief. Of course, Ice Wave, X39, Eon, and Glutathione. And we don't typically talk about glutathione for pain relief, but um, or discomfort relief. Thank you, Tim. That was wonderful. Back to you. Uh, thank you. I just wanted to say also, uh, we could all share these stories on Vibrant Living and Live Younger. <laughs> Yay, yes. Absolutely. And, and guys, that's what I did with my shoulder pain, because you can only wear them so long. And if it would, the pain would start coming back after the surgery, I would just put one of those patches there along with it. Sometimes I had, because I just leave them on, I might have seven or eight patches along there because as one would kind of wear off, I'd stick another one on. And so, yeah, just keep trying because it, it is amazing. 
All right. And, you know, pain, when you get, well, out of that horrible discomfort, um, it, it changes your life. It changes your life and what you can do. So who's next? I have one. Since right. we're on feet, we're on feet um, I get these terrible cramps where two toes go that way and three toes go that way. And one night I was, I jumped out of bed and the middle toe was so cramped that it was backwards. You know, the knuckle was pushing down. So grab the ice wave, can on top and the white on the bottom, like right below the ball of my feet on the foot, you know? And in like a minute and a half, the pain was gone. In about three minutes, it started to loosen up and it looked normal in 10 minutes. Oh, which that's is awesome. Like a miracle, because they're awful. They're like a 13, they're awful cramps. That's awesome. And Wendy, I'm glad you brought that up because um, my stepdaughter, who's very dear to me, I just want to call her my daughter. Anyway, she um, told me that she was having a terrible time with when her muscles would cramp in her legs and she would stick an Eon on and she said it would almost immediately go away. So, you know, I keep an yeah. Eon patch next to my bed in case I get a cramp in there. I, I, I don't think to try Eon because I kind of got hooked on Ice Wave when I was out in Colorado. And one night, nothing worked. I was having like a whole body cramp. And I got on, I think YouTube and was watching David Schmidt videos. And he reminded me of all these different places. And I was in tears, I hurt so bad. So I put um, a pair on the bottom of my feet. And then I walked up the wrist and the elbow and the shoulder. And when I got to the shoulders, it just stopped like that. Wow. I started crying because I didn't hurt anymore. It was amazing. <laughs> crying and joy, right? Yeah, 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 because it was awful. Uh, sounds huh? terrible. <laughs> awesome. All right, thank you so much. And let's go, who's next? Anne Marie here. Hi, come on in. <laughs> Hi, Karen. Good Hi. to see you again. Thank so you. I have a couple of gold distributors that just can't come on Monday mornings because they're business entrepreneurs and Mondays are their Monday mornings are their busiest, busiest. And I've been asking them to come and tell their stories. So I'm going to tell them for they're they're almost identical. And there are two other two gold distributors in Maine. Uh, and so they're very, very, very busy, you know, running a business 24 seven. One's a massage therapy school and one is um, agricultural supply. And so they're baby boomers. And so like the rest of us before the patches, you know, they were dragging a lot, trying to get through their long days and literally seven days a week. So they both are now, it's been about a year that they've been on these. They're addicted to energy enhancers, two sets a day, X39, and Silent Night for sleeping because they weren't sleeping so well because of the stress. They love their businesses, but it's just long hours. And, you know, these have just made a huge difference. They can put in their time come home, relax, eat their dinner, and then have a good night's rest. So that's a big cheer for the Energy Enhancers, the X39, and Silent Nights. Do you know where they're putting the energy when they're wearing two sets? Um, they alternate, but their favorites are uh, Kidney One, Tan on the left, White on the right, of course, and Lung One. Okay. Tan on the left, white on the right. And X39, usually on C7, but sometimes they'll put it two finger widths below the navel. Okay. Kidney one's the bottom of the foot. Yes. Yep, yep, yep. Awesome. Okay. Thanks. And I do need to say, Anne Marie, you're looking great after your little fiasco. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you, know, you I, quickly, quickly tell people what happened and, and your results? I am going to post that on Vibrant Living. I just, it just takes time. You know, I, Facebook is not my number one thing to do. So I have to teach myself. But anyway, um, it was back in April, I guess. Uh, we were down at the North Carolina Seacoast Beach House for a week. And the first day we got there, I was just busy unpacking and moving stuff around. And I tripped on my own uh, Echo, beautiful Echo sandals that are wonderful, but have a nice tread on them. So it tripped on the carpet and I went face down, didn't have time to catch myself. I slammed my nose. It immediately started bleeding, got myself off the carpet into the kitchen floor before we messed up the carpet, grabbed the ice, 
put my head back, stopped the bleeding, and had my patches right there on the counter. And I put ice wave, tan here, white here, tan here, white here. So two sets of ice waves. I put an Eon over both of the tans. Uh, put an X39 because it was in the morning. I hadn't patched up yet, you know, very much. And so I fortunately could start fresh. And X39, I think on the back, yeah, C7. And I think I put one somewhere on my forehead. And within a minute, a minute, the pain was gone. And it was excruciating. And I couldn't breathe. My nose was immediately felt like it had cement in it. I couldn't breathe, which really scared me. And, um, so the Eon helped thing, to calm things down. And uh, I decided to call the emergency room. I thought maybe they should just take a look at, at maybe to get an x-ray, see if I broke my nose, what happened. And I was pretty sure I had. And um, so, we, you know, before I went to the emergency room, I decided being a health nut and a naturopath, I decided I wanted to go to two health food stores first in case they admitted me. I wanted to have my good stuff with me. So I got all my nice little drinks and stuff to take and uh, got in the emergency room. I had eight patches on my face and uh, they never told me to take them off or ask. They didn't even ask what they were. I just said, I just volunteered. I said, this is just something I'm using to help my pain and help the um, stuffiness and congestion. And they never once questioned me or you know, got nasty about the patches at all. And they, they did do a, um, a digital or a f finger exam and they found that I had a deviated, not a deviated septum. They were thankful I didn't. It was just a slight fracture. But anyway, Rob, I'm sorry for the long story. But so I, about three days later, I took some pictures. I had a picture, two pictures that day, but three days later, when uh, I wasn't so red in the face, I had big, 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 half circle or half moon uh, bruises under my eyes. And I think I sent you and Gregory a picture. And about five days later, there were no bruises. I did wear the patches each day, the way I just told you the configuration, I wore them. And within five days, no bruises. And this was with a fractured, a slight fracture in the nose. So I'll put that it on. That is amazing, Anne-Marie. That's what a great story. And sad though, I'm sorry you had to do that, but you know, the, the links we go to to have a story. <laughs> yeah, I don't recommend that one. <laughs> Not on purpose, right? None of us would do that, but thank you. And they but I do did recommend the protocol. <laughs> and, yes, exactly, exactly. Thank you for sharing that. And Robin, I'm glad you asked her to. Awesome. So Can we have, have time. For Karen, that. this is Kay again. I'm sorry to interrupt, but my oh, wonderful yeah. sponsor, Anne-Marie, uh, corrected me. Uh, I guess I gave the wrong point, so I want to make a correction. The point on the feet is called bladder 63 for back discomfort. And I'm, I don't know what I said, but that is the correct one. And thanks, Anne-Marie, for catching that. I don't want people not having results. So it's bladder 63. Thank you. Because I think it's you said 36. So that's just got flipped. Thank you so much. All right. Well, we do have time for another story. So who's going to bless us with another story? Could I ask a question? Oh, yes. Of course, Lynn. Go ahead. Hi, my name is Lynn. I have, this is building on the first stories that we had. I have a problem when I'm sending free samples out in the mail and the pain pills, I mean, the pain patches and X39. And they're, they don't seem to be enough to really address the problem. Nobody's getting results because they're not getting enough patches and I'm not there with them. So I'm trying to figure out how to handle this problem because a lot of the people have long-term serious back pain. Does anyone have a suggestion? You know, I'm going to jump in and somebody else might have a much better suggestion, but I really like to take them through the videos and stuff and, um, and have them get the patches. They have a 30 day money back guarantee. If they're far away, you know, they really need to get their own patches they, and they're going to get so much value for the money they spend. You can be very, very comforted knowing that, but I just basically have them go through the the videos so they get the interest and just send them one X39 and tell them they may not in 24 hours, there's a great chance they won't notice anything, but that wonderful things are happening on a cellular basis. And, you know, there's no risk. And 
and they need more patches and longer. And you most likely are not able to do that for everyone. They need to do it. And that's, that's sort of my feeling. Now, if you have someone real close or you want to do a, a, a gifting of more, um, of course, that's, that's something you can do. But on a long-term basis, that doesn't really work for most people. They, they really just need to share the information so people can understand that these work and feel confident enough to give it a try. And Thank that you. might be helpful. Thank you. Anybody gonna, have something else? I'm gonna to jump in too. Thanks, um, Robin. You know, because Ice Wave is a little trickier than the other patches um, and move like we shared earlier, trying different places is, is a good thing and watching some videos like Karen said, but when in doubt, I have people put Ice Wave on the total body pain points. And I use Kidney One a lot. It's one of my favorites because it's so simple and it's easy. And I'll, 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 oh, I can't put the picture up because it's on my computer, I'm on Gregory's. But um, you can just look up Kidney One and Helen, I think she put, a, I think it's in a nitty gritty, thank you, Judy 101 uh, for protocols. I think you can see it there, but you can search for it also because it does total beta. I was talking to someone new and I had sent some ice wave, same thing then. And, you know, he had, pain in several places. And I just had him put it on the bottom of his feet for his back pain. And then a few minutes later, he said, Oh, my knee pain is gone. I didn't even know he had knee pain. And then he said, Oh, my back pain is gone too. So it's just a good thing with ice wave because it is a little, you know, it's a little more of a learning curve to learn the clock method for acute spots. Anyone else want to share? Can I just, just say Robin that I did send the, the patching protocols, David's patching protocols, the three videos, so he did review those, he and his wife, and that does include kidney one. Great, great. Okay. Yeah, and ice, ice wave is really tricky because I had it for two months, I guess, and I gave up on it. I couldn't get it to work. And when I cramped up in Colorado, Helen did the clock and it's like, okay. And I'd done everything the way it says to, but I never got it to work. And after she did it on me, I've been able to do it ever since. It's wild. So go kidney one. Anyone can find that. That's simple. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Yeah. Great yeah. Suggestion. Great. Great Thanks both of you. That's awesome. So we really are at the end of our time slot for sharing, but I'll bet you anything. Robin has some announcements. So um, <laughs> thank you everybody for coming in, blessing our community. Thanks for welcoming me back. I'm so happy to be back and you will have Michelle with you next week. And Robin, I'm going to turn it over to you. Oh, great. Thank you, Karen. We love having you back and we're glad you're doing so well. And this is just a beautiful community to be held in, no matter what we're going through, the, the joys and challenges of life, we have each other. And, you know, people come in through the business, the product, the community, but, you know, in times of joy and challenges, there's nothing like the community. So I do want to make a few announcements. Um, tonight, we are going to be celebrating uh, two new directors. Very exciting. Um, Candy actually... Uh, achieved the top six recruiter sponsor in all of North America. And she's one of our new directors and her sponsor, uh, Jeannie Angel Cowgirl is going to be on also. And they, and they got to direct her because they've got three new managers. So we have a really fun call this evening around that. Um, our doctor on uh, tomorrow night and please do come bring and share your stories on Tuesday night because see how helpful it is on these calls on Tuesday night it's helpful too so come share on Tuesday night we have Dr. Barbara with us uh, this week is a LifeWave Connect with David and he's going to be talking about uh, removing toxins very very important topic um, if you weren't on the 30 minutes of wisdom does anyone want to say a, a quick uh, comment about the 30 minutes of wisdom last week with Donna Blevins. Unmute your line. Oh, Sarah, unmute your line. Oh, it was absolutely wonderful. I so connected to that woman, that, that tall woman and her authentic uh, way of talking and the amazing message. I mean, she had, in a way, she had such a disadvantage being so tall and having a, a husband who's five foot three and she's six foot five. And yet she 
she just is all herself and just uh it's amazing to talk to her and i just feel so connected to her and it was a wonderful wonderful uh sharing that she gave us great it was, it was, yeah someone else i signed up as a minute, uh, minute we got off of the zoom i signed up for everything <laughs> <laughs> uh, lots of people did and and the link is in it will be in the newsletter today she's offering a class on mind shifting. If you really want to get to a new place, it can happen like that. And she's going to give the tools to do that. She's offering two different classes. They're just different Saturdays. You can go to both for the big price of $11. So <laughs> $5.50 a class. You can, it's the same material, but it'll be different interactions. Um, I just love this woman. And she's a professional poker player. And she, she coaches poker players and they have amazing success. So that's happening. Um, we have distributor training, of course, on Saturday morning. Uh, last week was fabulous uh, with Judy and Gregory and they're all in the Live Younger YouTube. Um, the company is starting events and this summer they're gonna have something called the Summer Summit. So the link uh, to get on that is in the newsletter and we have lots of events going on around the country now. Uh, David's gonna be traveling. Um, Ryan and Emily will be traveling uh, June 26th in the Hilton Long Beach. David's gonna be there. Uh, the link to register is there. They do have limited seating. So if you know anyone in LA, Orange County, San Diego, get them there. Uh, July 15th, Gregory and I are gonna be up with our Colorado team, Helen, Tim, Michelle, Dr. Barbara, and the, other, the rest of the gang on July 15th. And then there's proposed corporate event in Denver on July 17th. We're waiting for confirmation. So that one's not confirmed yet. We're getting that, well, as soon as we get it, we'll let you know. August 7th is in Branson, Missouri, and that's a corporate event. There's the virtual summit on August 21st. Um, uh, we're, we're looking at a few other possibilities in Sarasota, Phoenix and Texas. So stay tuned. And then November 12th to 14th, the company's having a convention and it will be live and virtual. So more details will be unfolding. We'll be hearing lots about that. Then there's a really cool thing going on. It's a, a soundbite testimonial contest and a 20 second or less soundbite. And if they choose yours and they're gonna choose a lot, they're gonna send a sleeve of X39. So, so that's exciting. So like I said, there's a lot, lot, lot going on. And um, do read the uh, newsletter carefully. Um, it's, it's a, there's a lot in there. So- Robin, um, Robin. Yes. Where, where, where do we find the list of all these events? Well, um, it's not available yet. It'll be in the newsletter. So we'll have that in the newsletter. And then there's, you know, I'm, sh if you stay, you know, the best thing to do is to stay tuned to uh, the corporate Facebook group, LifeWave Business Builders. If you're not on there, um, that's where a lot, that's where I pick up a lot of information. Okay. So that's important if you're not going there, if you're active in the business, very, very powerful. Um, lot, Emily does live trainings. For those of you that social media is not your thing, Braxton, our social media guy, did a training on social media, especially for uh, you know people that are brand new to social media. So there's there's resources everywhere, and we try to give you you know a, a good overview. Any other questions from anyone? Hey, Robin, it's Helen. What about uh, being able to uh, win an X39 by sharing on vibrant living? That's oh my gosh, way, you know, right? that, part, that part, I didn't, I sent the story of the week. Oh my gosh, we have a contest going on for all summer for the most engagement in stories. And this week's winner is a really touching story on um, mental health. And every week we look at the greatest engagement of stories on vibrant living and we choose that and send us a sleeve of X39 for that. So you guys have a lot of great stories you've shared today. Um, go to Vibrant Living, uh, share your stories and you too could win. Thank you, Helen, always. You always remind me and keep me on track. I was going through the newsletter and we hadn't put that part in yet. It's ready to go in though. Okay, anyone else? 
Wonderful call. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, everyone, for being with us. So at this time, we will say goodbye, and hopefully we'll figure out how I'm not so fuzzy anymore. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. Thank you, Karen. Thank you. Aloha. Aloha.